good evening all today we are going to discuss about the linux programming first in the linux programming we are discussing about the files api files api files api this is the files the linux files api it will be giving or describing the applications of interfaces of with the file means user can interact with the files with the help of this files api so in this we have different types of uh, uh, applications or we can call it as a system calls also system calls with the help of that system calls in the linux programming or linux operating system we can manipulate or we can access or we can uh, remove any uh, op operations you can perform with the help of files with the help of this files api okay normally but before we are going to discuss about the files api so in the linux programming or in the linux environment we have different types of files okay the first one is the we have different types of general file apis okay the files are divided into different types first one is the regular files regular files next one is the directory files directory files third one is fifo files the files are categories divided into different types that are these all fourth one is the character file character device file i next fifth one is the block block device file okay normally in the c c++ java and other programming languages we will use with the help of only the regular files only in the a linux programming environment or linux programming we have this type of files in with the help of this files we will symbolic symbolic link files yes with the help of this type different types of files we can perform the different actions in the linux program okay these are the different types of files we have in the linux programming and then we will discuss about these things okay and then first we are going to discuss about the this file api means nothing but file api is providing the some of the operations or some it will be given the or uh, providing some of system calls to access the files or manipulating the files okay then we are going to discuss about the this file api operations what are the operations we have in the file api okay then first one is the s yes, normally we know when we are using a file means first we need to create the file so first one is the create file so each and every this system call we have a some of the uh, code with the help of code we are going to access or we are going to the operate in linux programming will execute that system calls okay and next the second one is the open file is after create after creation if you want to read or write anything then we need to open then third one is the transfer the data transfer data to a file to and from file okay these are the operations we can perform on the files okay fourth one is the close file close file and the fifth one quad rename file okay rename file sixth one is the query u u r y query file attributes file attributes 
and the seventh one change file attributes change file attributes okay next one is the eighth one is the truncate file truncate file okay these are the operations we can perform on the uh, files with the help of this file api so for each and every operation okay for each and every this for each and every operation we have a some system calls or we can call it as a some code okay with the help of that particular code is yes, we can perform these operations on the file okay so this is the with the help of this okay this special api is to create a different types of files okay we already discussed about the what are the different types of files available in the uh, linux programming okay to access that particular different file, specialized files so to create that particular different types of specialized files we can uh, we can use the special apis okay and next we are going to discuss about all those these operations one by by means what are the system calls available to perform this type of operations okay first operation is the open okay open second one is the read these are called as a system calls okay write next one is the else seek l seek next one is the close and s stat and f stat next one is the change mode change own means here we are going to change the owner permissions to one user id to another user id okay next u time next one is the link next unlink u mask okay these are the system calls available in the linux programming okay programming to access the files to perform the any operations on the files okay first we will discuss about the open okay this is open is file to open a file for a data access means it is already existing file in the system then you want to access the that particular data so then we will use the open system call okay 